Hello everybody, this is my week 3 critical analysis video. Um, added a new character to the game, added some new assets to the game, um, made the game over screen because there wasn't the, the transition between death and respawning was way too um, hard and it was just basically one second you're dead, as soon as your life hits zero, you're back to life. So now there's a game over screen and it gives the player options whether to restart, main menu, or quit the game. So let's start this up to show you how that works. I kind of made the new character kind of interactable, kind of, in the first level. Um, let me erase all my current data. Um, I believe we also put in the new doors done by the art department. Um, this guy is a uh, crazy peep. You can hear him talking to you. Um, when you go up, talk to him. He starts explaining things to you. Man, I'm crazy Pete. I'm your lookout for the. But you walk away. Fine. Leave when I'm not done talking to you. That's fine. If you don't want to know what you got and how to use it, or where to get him when they. But man, I'm crazy Pete. I'll just I'm your lookout. Stay for the here and. Before you head inside for a little Basically, he tells you what your tools do, um, how many uses you get out of each tool this before they break. This is used for unlocking doors that are locked. Be careful. After 10 minutes, um, there's really no lockpick item to pick up in the game. That's just, that's what Don't we just assume what the lockpick looks like because of the kind. That's what we got the image off of. Oh yeah. When you need an item, you and can buy them. He tells you about the store and how you can buy yeah, items and stuff like that. This is a video game. If you need something from me, press the pause button and then click the store. I do have and a yes, few items that will not I am the break, voice of Crazy Pete. Anyways, um, obviously that. modified. This is a screwdriver. It's That's the new screwdriver from the art department. Like I said before, my tools are cheap, uh, so look four at screws it. and done. On work. These the wire, are wire snips. Are wire it's snips. What they're for. You got it. They're used for cutting things. Fourteen cuts, though, and then it will There's also hard. something to stop oh, yeah. me from Almost forgot. leaving they when he's in the middle of the conversation. Your feet. Broken glass can hurt when not wearing them. Be careful. There are some things that can damage your shoes over time. Well, I'm sure you're in a hurry. I'll stand here and yell if I hear anyone else. And if this was a video game, I'm sure there's going to be some annoying pop-up text to tell you how to play again. So now we can begin to get in the game. Now that the music's picking up. Huh. That's weird. The music just stops when you got my guy. Anyways. Um, if you missed last week, this is the picking up the rocks. Sound effects and stuff like that. Break it to glass. Um, I'm going to show you the game over screen by dying on this broken glass. Is, it, is there sound on the broken glass? Yes, there's sound on the broken glass. But I'm going to kill myself on the broken glass quickly. Then it transitions to the game over screen. Can't move. Kind of has like a Resident Evil type feel to it. Uh, I'm just going to go to uh, the main menu. I'm going to go to... Actually, let's let's beat the first level. Oh, then, I, then I can show you Crazy Pete in the second level. Oh, I just want to get him to shut up. The man, I'm crazy. Shut up. I'm not going to talk. I don't care about that. Let's beat the level. I believe you put a, a new uh new door in here. These are our new doors. Apparently we're midgets. I don't know. We're little people. Um, I think next. We, oh, if we, if we have time for next week, uh, we might 
throw some animations on the door while picking it. So, so you get caught. Uh, this level, uh, Crazy Pete's actually outside of your cell window. He tells you he threw a uh, a pin in your jail cell, but then he forgot which jail cell he threw it in, either the one next to you or the one that you're actually in. You know that he tells you about. Uh, the security measures of the of the prison, about the electrified floors, and what's the purpose of having them? Why why uh, prisoners don't have shoes? Why there's broken glass on the floor? And it seems like somebody put sinks in here. Doesn't look like the pin is in here. None of the prisoners has shoes, so broken glass will hurt you. Find a pair of shoes or avoid the glass. Next, some of the security measures are a bit too harsh. They have a limited floor. The guards don't get hurt by them because they're wearing shoes. They're a floor. Careful. I do have a pair of shoes just for this situation, but like I said before, oh, they're pricey. There it is. It was rolling away. I'll see you at the end of the time. Yeah, it still does it. Pick up a rock and throw it at the guard. Just guard it. I don't think they put the new, uh, wire cutters in this level yet. I think that's, uh, next week, if it's not done by Tuesday, I think I'm gonna end up doing it. Yeah. Old wire cutters. So let's get out of here. It looks like some they replaced the, uh, the steps and the handrails. Uh, quite simplistic on the handrails. Um, oh, crap. Did I still jump on them? Prove my... Oh, man. Um, where are you going? Oh! What the heck was that? And obviously, the AI still needs a lot of work. Let's go cut those wires. you where Crazy Pete is in level 3. Level 3 is when uh, there's a whole electrified hallway uh, event pops down he comes popping out of the vent and explains to you what that is in front of you if you forgot what it was. So let's get this over with. I do like the stairs though. And I feel a little tiny. I just want to see if the uh, shoes are in here. If they are, they should be on the floor in the next room. No, they're not in here. Screwdrivers, though. Alright, so I got the screwdriver. Let's get out of here.
Um, I believe that there are no rocks in this level. The hell are his shoes? Maybe they're in here. Apparently there's ten places where the shoes can be in this level. Maybe behind this door. No. Uh, hey, buddy. Yeah, there he is. Watch out for the floor. It's electrified. If you don't have any shoes, I highly suggest that you go and find some. But be careful. Walking on this floor will damage your shoes. If your shoes completely melt, you will start taking damage. And it's not like broken glass. It will hurt you even if you're standing still. See you later. Alright, so let's go find some shoes. Shoes, shoes, shoes. Uh, shoes will be open. Let's see. I don't see them in here. Are they down here? No. Okay, I know there's somewhere. Someone tells me they're in a cell. There's a cigarette. Out of here. No. I do like the new doors because it's a lot easier to see inside of the cells. Shoes. Shoes. Okay. I knew there somewhere. Shoes. I'm just gonna go through this door again. I don't want him seeing me. There is a bug where if you are crouched and hold the shift key down, you won't be able to move no more. Uh, put on my shoes. Um, Alright. I'm just gonna jump. It's gonna take damage from me. Oh, no crap, it's still taking damage. Okay, so now my shoes are almost completely damaged. No, oh, I need to get this box out of here. What the hell is that? Are you serious? I, I'm just messaging my team right now. Anyways. That's a, a really uh, stupid, stupid thing. You can't get me. Oh man, this is good. Well, I'm going to conclude this playtest for today. Um, actually, let's uh, let's get killed by a guard here. Huh. This is how messed up the game is. I, I don't get it. Just kill me. Come on. I literally have to chase the guard. <laughs>